Hi, I'm James Schillinglaw. I'm here on Celebrity Beyond, and I'm here with Brian Abel, who is the Senior Vice President, Hotel Operations. And Brian yesterday gave us a great tour of this brand new Edge class ship. It's the third in a series of five. And we're going to find out all about the many great features of this vessel on Insider Travel Report. Now, Brian, I, I said you, you did a super job. We, we went up from top to bottom yesterday. We went to these amazing places. Uh, I had actually not been on an edge class. I was supposed to go two years ago uh, for the first, uh, the, you know, here in Southampton. Uh, but I was amazed. You really, it, was, it's, it really is an amazing ship. Well, yeah. Well, thank you very much. It's, uh, it's an honor, and I'm pr really proud of the result of the last three and a half years of building Celebrity Beyond, and now being able to show showcase it to the press and the media and to guests starting tomorrow is, is what really makes all the hard work, you know, pay off. Well, you, we actually started um, at that tour in a place you call the Grand Plaza, which, you know, is for lack of a better word, the atrium, but this is an atrium that really is the heart of the ship, right? Yeah, I mean, we look at the Grand Plaza because it's in the middle of the ship. It's three decks high, and we call it pretty much the heartbeat of the ship. It's where everyone comes to congregate, um, and we the inspiration behind it was to make it feel like a European piazza. Uh, so we have this, you know, beautiful circular bar in the middle the martini bar which yeah, is if you can go on all these levels and you can kind of catch who's who's at the martini bar now you know that was yeah it's like you know it's a who's who and you get to see you know people watch and see people and then the whole grand plaza is surrounded by all many of our specialty restaurants and bars so no matter where you are there's action going on people enjoying themselves we have great music either live music or dj so people are dancing on the bottom of the grand plaza and then it's just you know everyone's surrounding it um, having a great time and plus you have all these wonderful restaurants all around the outer including the famous the only danielle restaurant at sea uh, 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 uh le voyage right yeah one of the things we added to celebrity beyond was we wanted to have like the gem of our culinary creation and a fine dining um, restaurant. And we have our partnership with D Chef Daniel Ballou, and he's been a partner with us for the last few years um, doing training our, our team. Um, we actually send a lot of our chefs to his restaurants around the world to, to learn his style. Um, and then we had this opportunity to partner with him to create his first restaurant ever at sea. Um, and it's just, you know, again, the jewel of our culinary creation. Well, it's amazing because like, you and I were both at this wonderful event Celebrity had a few years ago where we, we actually got to eat in Danielle and, and go to the American Ballet Theater. And I was like, what? That was a pretty good evening. And how is that going to be realized when you're on board? Well, we just found out. Right? Yeah, no, it's again, uh, we've been partnering with Chef Danielle for a couple of years and we've been fe featuring one or two of his items in our sweet restaurant, Lumine. Uh, but this is the first time he's doing a full out restaurant with us. Uh, and it's both a a la carte menu and we're also going to have a seven course tasting menu. Now, the other thing you have uh, that, that you pointed out to me in the tour is you have these four main restaurants uh, that are all slightly themed differently. Uh, I think you said 75% of the menu is the same, but the 25% is more to the theme. And, and you, you seem to have carried off uh, something that I think one of your sister lines has tried to do a few years ago, but this one I think is going to work, right? Yeah, well, it's, we've already done it on Celebrity Edge and Apex, and our guests love it. You know, it's a typical cruise ship, has one big main dining room that seats, you know, over a thousand people. People, and we wanted to create the main dining, which is complimentary to all, to all of our guests. We wanted it to be a little bit more special, a little bit more intimate. So instead of having one, now we have four main dining rooms that seat like 400, 450 guests. So it starts feeling more like a real restaurant than a banquet hall. And we had the opportunity to create four different types of restaurants around different concepts. So we have an American restaurant, we have a French restaurant, an Italian restaurant, and a Mediterranean restaurant. So it's a nice, it adds more variety for our guests to enjoy. No, and they're beautiful. They're all de decorated differently. They're all different, slightly different cuisine, and it really kind of works. It's in, this, in the stern of the ship, uh, and, and it really is a nice place. Now, I want to gravitate. This ship is actually a little bigger than the other two, right? Yeah, Slurry Beyond is uh, 20 meters longer, and we actually added one more deck to it. So it gives us, you know, the guests more luxury to enjoy, uh, more variety, and more space. 
And yeah, so and, and you do it for that space. You have a new restaurant. You have a lot of bigger venues, and you have a bigger what they call the retreat, which is your kind of uh, suite area, uh, you know, private suite area with its own own restaurant and some pools and things and sun decks, right? Our retreat is our exclusive area for our suite guests. Uh, we have over 200 suites on Celebrity Beyond. We actually added 22 suites, um, and the retreat has the retreat lounge. Luminate the retreat restaurant and then the retreat sun deck, which is now two stories tall and it has two big jacuzzis overlooking e either side of the ship. It's all its own pool, bar. So it really gives our suite guests um, an exclusive area to go to uh, that's a little bit more private and a little bit more special for them. And it is. It's really a thing. And I, I was amazed at the space involved up there. Uh, now, the uh, other thing is is you have in the stern of the ship, you have some new areas too. Uh, the Sunset Bar, which is brand new, right? Yeah, in fact, um, though the Sunset Bar we had, um, but we just felt like we had the opportunity on this ship because it is longer to make the Sunset Bar even more special. So uh, we partnered with Nate Burgess, who's a great designer from the US, and we made the Sunset Bar almost twice the size. Uh, and it's, it's really inspired by Nate's work, um, work around the world, so it, whether it's from LA and San Francisco to Morocco to Uruguay um, to Greece, it, it feels like a really special place. And um, we're able to serve food there now too. So the guests are loving it. Um, it's just a beautiful area to enjoy the weather and to enjoy um, the views that we it is, show. It is gorgeous back in the stern. Now the last thing I want to close on is you got great entertainment venues. We're actually in the club, uh, which is a two-level uh, nightclub. They have lots of games. They have other things going on here. And then the theater itself is amazing. It's so beautiful there. And then, of course, Eden. Talk a little bit about those three three places. Yeah, I mean, um, I think entertainment, what we're finding is it's becoming more and more important to our guests. Um, so we wanted to spend a little bit more time coming up with unique, innovative, creative entertainment. So the theater um, on Celebrity Beyond is just marvelous. We have state-of-the-art uh, 4K LED screens that are 110 feet long, uh, that are, have 12 different panels that um, move it around and it really enhances the different shows that we have in there. Um, here in the club, um, this is kind of what we say in the club is that it's every hour is social hour at the club. And during the day we do a lot of activities, game shows, uh, we have archery in here, we have a golf simulation in here, uh, we have our version of an escape room. And then at nighttime it turns more into a club, we have live band, we have uh, Bring the Brass, which is all like a jazz thing, we have um, Soul Town. Uh, and then we have our own production shows in here. Uh, this one, one of the big ones here is uh, the, the Jazz Joint. And yeah, that's tonight, I think. That's tonight, you have to go check it out. And it's really um, around like a 1920s prohibition club that we turned this into. And then of course Eden, which is amazing. I went last night. Uh, it is a, you have to go there. It's very unique. Uh, it is uh, during the day. It is a sort of restaurant, bar, beautiful views in the in the stern. Uh, at night, it turns into a nighttime, almost nightclub experience with a show. Right? Yeah, I mean Eden is um, in the back of the ship. It's also three deck high. We like to say at Eden, it's um, chillful in the morning, playful in the afternoon, and then wonderful at night. And at nighttime, we do different shows in there. We also do acoustic bands back there. Um, and it's because it's in the back of the ship, it has 270 degree windows of the outside. So you're always looking at a great view. Uh, and then we have another specialty restaurant back there called Eden Restaurant. That's delicious. Yeah, well, I have to go back and check that out. Now, just one last question. What is your favorite new feature on this, on this Celebrity Beyond? No, that's hard to say because there's a lot of new features. I mean, one, I think the Grand Plaza, because we made it bigger um, and we have more terracing, I think the energy in there is just fabulous. Um, but to me, my favorite part of this ship or any of our ships is, is the crew because you can have a beautiful ship with great design, great programming, but it's our crew that brings it to life. And it's the crew that's kind of the soul of the ship. Um, and you can have, again, great food, great entertainment, uh, but it has to be the crew that provides the seamless, effortless service to our guests to really enjoy everything. Well, Brian, I want to thank you for spending some time with us. Thank you for that wonderful tour yesterday. Really give me a, a real feel for what it was like, uh, what Celebrity Beyond is like, and why it is an advancement from your previous two Edge Class ships. And I'm looking forward to the spending the rest of the day here exploring around. I, I wish I had more time. Yeah, well, my pleasure. And definitely don't work too hard to ex experience the ship. Uh, there's a lot to experience. And make sure you come back again soon.
I certainly will. I'm James Schillinglaw, and this is Insider Travel Report.